Odiogo.com, the web read for you. Australian bill allows for sterilizations without parental consent at any age. Following the call by ethicists for afterbirth abortions and the press explosion surrounding the euthanasia coaster, new legislation from Australia is now paving the way for children of any age to consent to sterilization, without parental consent. That's right, if a psychiatrist determines that a child under the age of 18 years is sufficiently mature, they will be sterilized without any say from the parents. Again, there is no age minimum, as long as they are mature enough. The legislation, known as the Draft Mental Health Bill 2011, also allows for 12-year-olds to consent to psychosurgery and electroshock. You can view the bill for yourself on the Australian Mental Health Government website. Written by the Western Australia Mental Health Commission MHC and overseen by Mental Health Commissioner and Clinical Psychologist Mr Eddie Bartnick, objections can still be submitted to Australian parliamentary members in each state until March 9. Some main points of the bill read, children of any age to consent to sterilization, if a psychiatrist decides that a child under 18 years has sufficient maturity, he or she will be able to consent to sterilization. Parental consent will not be needed. Only after the sterilization procedure has been performed does it have to be reported and then only to the chief psychiatrist. Pages 135 and 136 of the Draft Mental Health Bill 2011 12-year-olds will be able to consent to psychosurgery, banned in NSW and the NT. Psychosurgery irreversibly damages the brain by surgery, burning or inserting electrodes. This draft bill proposes to allow a 12-year-old child, if considered to be sufficiently mature by a psychiatrist, to be able to consent to psychosurgery. Once the child has consented it goes before the Mental Health Tribunal MHT for approval. Parental consent is also not needed for the MHT to approve the psychosurgery. Pages 108, 109, 110, 197,198, 199, 213, 12-year-olds will be able to consent to electroshock ECT. Electroshock is hundreds of volts of electricity to the head. Any child aged 12 and over, whom a child and adolescent psychiatrist decides is mature enough, will be able to consent to electroshock. Also, once consent is given, there is no requirement for parents or anyone, including the MHT, to approve the electroshock. Electroshock should be banned. Its use on the elderly, pregnant women and children is especially destructive. Pages 100, 101, 103, 104, 194, 105 Action will need to be taken to make sure the bill does not pass. Objections can be sent to the Mental Health Commission and to Australian state legislators. Feedback options come to a close on the 9th of March at 5 p.m., so it is important to voice your opposition today. Here are a few ways to contact the Mental Health Commission and state your objection to the bill. Email, contact us at mentalhealth.wa.gov.au mail. GPO Box X2299 Perth Business Centre, WA. 6847 Find Australian Mental Health Ministers, Health Ministers and Local Members of Parliament, www.parliament.wa.gov.au slash parliament slash memblist.nsf slash wallmember source related posts. <laughs>